A Quiet Place is a film that took the world by storm. It was just so exciting and fun to watch from beginning to end. And what's even more cool, it wasn't just the first film that was received well from critics and audiences. The sequel was pretty damn amazing as well. And with a prequel film coming out later this week, and with a sequel on the way coming out next year, it definitely seems like A Quiet Place is setting out to become the next iconic horror franchise. Which is pretty insane, considering the fact it comes from this gentleman. You know, the guy that made us laugh for years in the office. However, I guess working a pointless 9 to 5 really started to suck the soul out of Jim, and the comedy went right out the window. It probably put him in a very dark, depressing state, which led to the birth of A Quiet Place. And I'm sure anyone can relate to this. After all, if you've worked a dead-end office job, you probably actually really do know what depression feels like. Michael, what's wrong? Everything is wrong, Dwight. The stress of my modern office has made me depressed. Depressed? Isn't that just a fancy word for feeling bummed out? Dwight, you ignorant slut. However, if that feeling of isolation and helplessness from your real life is not enough, well then I have great news for you. Because now we have a video game on the way coming later this year, where you can experience firsthand what it feels like to be in a world where the slightest noise could lead to certain death. A Quiet Place The Road Ahead is a single player horror adventure game inspired by the critically acclaimed blockbuster movie franchise that highlights a unique survivor story after an invasion of deadly creatures. In this exclusive spin-off, experience the journey of a young woman who must endure a treacherous apocalypse in the midst of interpersonal family conflicts, all while coming to terms with her own inner fears. So yeah, this game seems to have a lot going for it. A licensed IP video game, a unique story experience, deadly creatures, family conflicts that actually matter, and inner fears we must overcome. What more could one ask for in a video game? Now I know what you're thinking. Hey, we could always just have our character live by a waterfall. Well, you most likely cannot do that due to unforetold events that have yet to be revealed to us in the game's plot. Maybe we're searching for our family members that we have unresolved issues with. Maybe we just like living away from the waterline and enjoy walking barefoot on small paths made out of sand. I really have no clue. I mean, I would rather live by a waterfall in some sort of cabin or house and enjoy the simple things in life like talking and sighing instead of being in constant fear of being ripped to shreds due to the fact that I made the slightest noise. But hey, who am I to judge other people's life choices in an apocalypse? Now you could make you the argument, oh, I'll just be quiet. After all, these monsters are only able to hunt by sound. Boop, I got another problem coming your way, because in this game, your character has asthma. All kidding aside, I actually am sort of excited for this game. I really do enjoy the franchise, and I don't mind the cat and mouse horror experience we get in these type of games. I've been playing Still Wakes the Deep lately and having a complete blast with it. In fact, the gameplay footage in this video is from that game. The Road Ahead does seem to follow the same formula that was made popular by Alien Isolation. You know, it really does show the legacy that Alien Isolation left behind in the gaming industry. The fact that it basically birthed an entire genre. That being said, The Road Ahead seems to take it a step further and doesn't mind borrowing other aspects from Alien Isolation. As you can see in the trailer, the protagonist is using some sort of sensor to help identify how close the monsters are. Not to mention being caught most likely just results in a game over. You're not going to be able to outrun these alien creatures. At least, not if the game's well designed. So hopefully, the road ahead handles stealth mechanics correctly because I would really like to get the same type of experience and vibe that Isolation offer. No game has lived up to that feeling in the last decade. And yes, I said decade because Alien Isolation was released 10 years ago. And from the look of things, we're never gonna get a sequel to that masterpiece. And yeah, we have IGN to thank for that one. So I want a quiet place, the road ahead, to actually give me a reason 
to slowly creep through interesting environments. I want to use distraction items as I try to stealth past these terrible alien predator creatures. Plus, give me some interesting plot twist. If they do all this, we're going to have a winning formula on our hands. And since the game is being developed by Stormmind Games, there's absolutely no excuse for this game to have a boring story. After all, the weirdness that comes out of that studio is nothing to scuff at. What happened, my dear? The record player got jammed again, right? Yes, I know. You, you keep on telling me we need to buy the new gadgets on the market. Promise, promise, promise. But I would love to hear what you all think. Are you guys excited for the road ahead? Do you have plans on seeing the prequel movie later this week? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. By the way, if you made it this far and did enjoy the video, let me know by dropping a like. And if you are new, please consider subscribing. As for me, I got a ton of work to do, so I'm going to get back to the grind and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.